Well, Michael Jai will have you getting absolutely fine. Uh, so third season of Inside Edge uh, will uh, make you happy, but at the same time, uh, if you are comparing it with the previous episode, uh, previous to both the seasons, uh, it might slightly disappoint you as well. Uh, all in all, speaking with respect to the story, during the first season and second season, when they came, just the reason the characters are kind of developed, uh, they we do get to see a lot of surprises in the end. Uh, like uh, for example, uh, the Bhaisab's character or uh, Ko Biroz, or even Richard Adda's character, I have. Uh, uh, seen her uh, grow from the first season to now to the third season. Uh, character development has been super, super amazing. Uh, even Bayou, uh, Bayou's character has uh, developed in a way uh, that we never expected that to be. And uh, Sayani is on a uh, altogether different track. Uh, so with respect to the story, it, uh, according to me, I slightly found out uh, the story to be a little bit lengthy and 10 episodes again, not necessary at all. You could easily create around like your story third season ki specifically hai. Uh, it could have easily gone uh, for somewhere around uh, six to seven episodes, honestly, mm-hmm. because breather episodes are not really that much necessary. We just want to know what happens at the end, uh, and that end will definitely uh, give you a different uh, point of view uh, because uh, now they are trying to uh, legalize betting uh, in uh, cricket. And just the, uh, after uh, X, uh, like if I uh, have uh, 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 trailer already, but then you know that uh, there would be a match between India and Pakistan, and based on that, Agi uh, just told him. In the end, uh, we get to see a lot of surprising things, uh, which are which I which are definitely surprising uh, according to me. Uh, and uh, overall, all in all, if story as well as cinematography, ki baat ki jai, uh, then the portrayal of the story is uh, kind of slow. Uh, but cinematography wise, it was amazing, amazing. Uh, with respect to acting. All actors have given uh, almost their best as much as they could. Uh, if you talk about Sayani, if you talk about specifically Raja Zanda and Vivek Oberoi, uh, both of their characters have a different journey overall in this entire season, uh, but they have uh, done a super, super amazing job. And even Vaisab's character, the way he, he, he was presented uh, in the finale of uh, season 2 or uh, with respect to that, uh, season 3 is going to take a very different angle. I don't want to spoil it for you. Uh, so, all in all, uh, yes, I can if season 1 and season 2 bhi nahi dekha hoga, then I could tell you that you can directly start from season 3 and it would not matter that much because it is altogether a different angle uh, towards the story now uh, apart from what happened in the past uh, na- and yeah that is it for the, as spoiler free as I could make the review because uh, there are a lot of things to talk to because, because if I get into it then the review would all absolutely be uh, spoilers would be there and the story would be revealed but I don't want to do that uh, so thank you so much for watching until here. Uh, do check it out. Uh, it is on Amazon Prime. And uh, if you have no, well, if you haven't seen the episode season one or season two yet, you can directly start season three. Um, it will make a lot of sense to you because Amazon Pay left side where you get a, get to see a lot of trivia behind what things have happened in the past. Uh, so do check it out on Amazon. Uh, all the, all the episodes are streaming now. And uh, thank you so much for watching until here. Uh, please 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 subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed yet. I'll be meeting you the next video.